10,000 likes in one minute? I can't believe this shit. I be feeling like the man when I walk through. This shit is ridiculous right now. Like, I think I'm about to get verified and everything. I don't even, I don't, I don't care about the haters no more. Fuck what they talking about. What they be saying? Haters gonna hate? That's what they do, huh? I don't fuck about none of that. Let me look at these DMs again. This is crazy. You gotta see these DMs. Everybody is hitting me up right now. Whoopi Goldberg just asked me for some fucking merch. I can't believe it. I gotta make sure it's the color purple. I got to meet so many celebrities tonight. So many of my childhood celebrities that I looked up to. Like Stone Cold Steve Austin. I got to meet Stone Cold Mr. Ain't that the bottom line, bitch. Bay, did you see Hurricane Chris in there? Man, I thought that nigga was locked up on murder, y'all. Bud. Yeah, where is it? You trying to smoke? I asked Zinger. Oh, 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 Marie. What's the issue? No issue. So why you got an attitude? No attitude. Hmm. That's strange. Normally, when you want to smoke, it's to calm yourself down. What's the matter, like? I took a picture with Nicki Minaj. I bet you she... posted her too, huh? Oh, my God. Actually, that was going to be my next post. Mm. So, no. What I don't understand. Oh, so you are mad. Fuck yes, I'm mad. You just said you weren't mad. No, I said I don't have an issue and I don't have an attitude. There's a difference. Maybe if you pay closer attention to your woman instead of being out here catering to C-list and D-list celebrities. C and D-list celebrities? Nicki Minaj is an A-list celebrity. Don't cut me off, nigga. I'm talking. You've been chit-chatting all night with the peanut gallery. Oh, did you see my last video? It got 100K views. Oh, my last sketch. Newsflash, no one cares about your social media. This was a Hollywood party, Malcolm. Hmm. So why didn't you post me? <laughs> okay, so you're mad because you didn't get any followers tonight. <laughs> I got five million followers, baby. I'm good. Trust me, this is about you. Always putting everybody else before me. Stone Cold Steve Austin? Hurricane Chris, really? Who the fuck is that? Kevin Hart, who disrespected your ass. Oh shit, I do gotta post that Kevin Hart picture. Thank you for reminding me. You know I'm taller than that nigga, and he had the nerve to call me Lil Homie. Bro, you're 5'7". Step on your ass. Are you even listening to me? Yes, Marie. But I posted you. On a story. On a 24-hour disappearing story that lasts for 15 seconds, all of which I occupied, what, mm, five seconds of? Because I was in the background walking to the bathroom. Hmm, okay. So you're jealous mm. because all eyes were on me tonight. <laughs> mm-hmm. You know what, Malcolm? I'm not even gonna deal with you tonight, baby. Just tell me where the bud is so I can roll up and go to sleep. I'm not even gonna waste my time. Just tell me where the bud is. Okay, so you wanna know where the bud is? Mm -hmm. Wanna keep using my shit? Mm -hmm. That's crazy. This night was supposed to be about me, but you fucking it up because I'm getting verified in the morning. <laughs> <laughs> Man, I was nominated for the Influencer of the Decade. And you didn't even have the decency to congratulate your man. Hmm. I'm sorry, Malcolm. Did I forget to stroke your tiny little dick like everybody else did tonight? I'm sorry. I just don't think being an influencer for the last 10 years is an actual accomplishment. But I'm sure when you get on Clubhouse tomorrow with your little 112 followers, they'll be happy to hear all about it. Tomorrow when you sit online for six hours explaining how to give a tutorial about a sketch. Newsflash, pick up your phone, press record, and it's done. Now tell me, where's the motherfucking bud before I literally fuck you up? It's in my shoebox, Marie. The same place it always is every time you ask for it.
So you really think social media views don't matter? After everything I said to you, you're worried about if people care about your views. Just answer the question. You answer the question. What question? You asked the question. What question? What? 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 You know what? What? Admit it. Admit what? got five million followers and no blue check and you're upset because I'm about to get verified but the thing is you gave up you gotta accept it okay Malcolm let's get into it shall we you don't give a fuck about me you never post me on your page I'm like your little secret that you just sneak around town with a little secret get the fuck out of here listen my business is my business. I like to keep my business private so nobody fucks up my relationship. So yes, I like to keep things private, if you don't mind. So maybe you just don't want your little OnlyFan groupie hoes to know that you're in an actual relationship. OnlyFans, get the fuck out of here. That's rich. Rich got the OnlyFans, bitches. What are you saying? And I know you're not talking. You just posted your ex on a throwback Thursday picture. That was a graduation photo, and it was 20 of us in the pic. You are a fucking clown. Crop the nigga then. Crop him out. You're the queen of all this editing photos and taking hours to put filters on photos. But you've never gotten dressed once during this fucking pandemic unless you're doing a fucking TikTok challenge. You don't even get dressed around this motherfucker unless it's for TikTok. Shit is ridiculous. You are so defensive. Is it too much to ask to be a part of your page? Is it too much to ask to be in one photo on the most important night of your life? I got dressed up for you tonight and you didn't even want to take a picture with me. Not to mention that was a party I took you to. Those were my people. I put you on my man. And what? You wanna go out Hollywood on me? Who was there when you were only getting 20 views? I was in your first at least 30 videos. Now what? I can't even make a cameo, huh? That's cool. I don't need to be in your videos anymore. But to not even be in one picture, that shit hurt. I said I'm sorry, Marie. How many times do you want me to say it? Never. I never want you to say sorry. You never think about how your actions make me feel. You never even consider it. So never, I never want you to apologize. I want you to man the fuck up and hold me down from jump. I love you, Marie. No, you don't. No. Listen, I do. If I didn't, then I wouldn't have posted your picture on my page like I did hours ago. But you're so worked up and worried about the wrong shit that you missed it. Yeah, I posted you on the story, as well as my main page. So how about you get on your motherfucking phone and go look? Mm-hmm. Shaking like a fucking stripper. What's that? Huh? What's, what's that? <laughs> Shit funny now, huh? Yeah. 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 Baby! <laughs> mm-hmm. Mm -hmm.